Knowledge Will says hello! Ooh. It's a tradition in Denmark that if you're still single when you turn 25, you're doused in cinnamon. According to the World Health Organization, suicide rates have increased by 60% worldwide in the last 45 years. In fact, there's an approximate mortality rate of 16 per 100,000 people, or one death every 40 seconds. France is the first country to ban plastic plates, cups, and utensils. A law was passed that comes into effect in 2020. The new law is part of the country's Energy Transition for Green Growth Act, the same legislation that also outlawed plastic bags in grocery stores and markets. Saturn's rings are made up of dust, rock, and ice, accumulated from passing comets, meteorite impacts on Saturn's moons, and the planet's gravity pulling material from the moons. The Titan beetle, known as Titanus giganteus, is the largest known beetle in the Amazon rainforest and one of the largest insects in the whole world. It can grow up to 6.5 inches long. They have mandibles that can easily snap a pencil in half. <laughs> David the Bullet Smith, who is on season 7 of America's Got Talent, has been shot from a cannon more than 5,000 times. He's the highest flying human cannonball in the world today with his world record breaking human cannonball shots. Phobophobia is the abnormal fear of developing a phobia or anxiety about showing symptoms of a phobia. Greenland is the largest island in the world. It has an area of 822,700 square miles. Olympus Mons, located on Mars, is the largest volcano and mountain in the solar system. It's over 16 miles high, which is three times the height of Mount Everest. There were 12 confirmed dogs on the Titanic. Unfortunately, only three of them survived. A year on the planet Mercury takes 88 Earth days. This is because Mercury is nearly tidally locked to the sun, and over time, this has slowed the rotation of the planet to almost match its orbit around the sun. The word laser is an acronym that stands for light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. Fireflies are actually beetles, not flies. Most of them are winged and are from the same family as glowworms. Charles Darwin and Abraham Lincoln were both born on the same day and year, February 12th, 1809. Not only that, but they both loved Shakespeare, they both lost their mothers at an early age, and both were abolitionists. The human small intestine is 20 feet long and about one inch in diameter. Can hold a lot of poop. The line that separates the top and bottom numbers of a fraction is called a vinculum. In 2009, Bill Gates released mosquitoes into an audience that was there to hear him speak about malaria education and eradication. Malaria is transmitted from person to person via mosquito bites. According to the Guinness World Records, Bluey, an Australian cattle dog from Rochester, Victoria, in Australia, was the oldest dog ever recorded. He was 29 years five months. He was born in 1910 and was put to sleep on November 14, 1939. Kangaroos are unable to move backwards. The combination of their muscular legs, big feet, and tails may help kangaroos move forward and hop effectively, but these appendages also prevent them from going in reverse. Sexual cannibalism is actually common in the insect world. It's when one partner, usually the female, eats the other after mating. This is why praying mantis males become motionless after mating, to avoid being eaten. The microwave oven was invented by accident. In 1945, engineer Percy Spencer was working in a lab testing magnetrons. One day while working near the magnetrons that produced microwaves, he noticed a candy bar in his pocket was melting. This is how the microwave oven was born. The opossum is immune to bee stings, scorpion stings, rattlesnake venom, and toxins such as botulism. Optical illusion speed bumps are being used to slow drivers down. One of them is a three-dimensional little girl chasing a ball. This was first introduced in Vancouver and now other provinces and states in the United States are experimenting with it. Naked mole rats are rodents but live like many insects. They live in colonies and are led by a queen or dominant rat. 
The queen is the only female to breed and bear young. According to researchers at the University of Aberdeen in Scotland, binge watching TV shows together can bring you closer as a couple. The study found that if you lack mutual friends in the real world, the characters on the shows you watch together become a good substitute. The latest update to Samsung Pay allows you to pay for things with just your retina, but only if you have the Galaxy Note 7. Australian truck driver Bill Morgan was in a near fatal accident when he was crushed in a truck accident and had a heart attack. But I say near fatal because he was clinically dead for more than 14 minutes. However, he survived after being in a coma for 12 days. His luck doesn't run out there either. He also won the lottery twice. With the first winning scratch ticket, he won a car worth $17,000. And during a reenactment for a Melbourne TV show, he purchased another ticket and won a jackpot of $170,000. The only known albino gorilla to live was Snowflake. He was born in the wild, but was captured in 1966 by villagers and lived in the Barcelona Zoo. He died of skin cancer in 2003. And according to Spanish researchers, Snowflake was the result of inbreeding between possibly an uncle and a niece. At the Hidoping Research and Conservation Center for the Giant Panda in the Wolong Nature Reserve in China, researchers would dress up as pandas to prepare panda cubs for the release into the wild. They would wear costumes to try and deter from the babies getting attached to humans. In 2002, Sesame Workshop created an HIV positive character to be in the cast of the South African co-production of Sesame Street. The Muppet was designed to promote tolerance and reduce the stigma associated with being positive with HIV AIDS. She was a five-year-old who contracted the disease through a tainted blood transfusion. The Swiftlet's nest is made out of the bird's own saliva. In Asian countries, the bird's nest is boiled into a soup and is considered a delicacy. A single bowl of bird's nest soup can run you around $100. That's a, that's a, that's a lot of money for bird spit. There is an 18 karat gold fully functional toilet called America at the Guggenheim Museum. It was created by Italian artist Maurizio Catalan, is installed in one of the museum's small single unit restrooms, and visitors are encouraged to use it. In 2014, a London London parking space sold for 400,000 pounds. That was 2.5 times the cost of the average UK home. Really, how lazy are you that you need that good of a spot? Mm -mm. The nation's oldest carousel is the Flying Horses Carousel, located in Oak Bluffs on Martha's Vineyard. It was built in 1876 and is still running. It is one of 20 surviving carousels that includes a ring machine, and people who grab the ring get a free ride. Alaska has its own version of Groundhog Day called Marmot Day. This is because Alaska doesn't have any groundhogs. Jellyfish eat and poop out of the same orifice. I guess that's great if you're a minimalist. Pluto has a heart-shaped expanse known as the Tomba Regio that is made of ice, huge glaciers made of nitrogen, methane, and carbon dioxide. Angel Falls in Venezuela was accidentally discovered in 1935 by Jimmy Angel, a bush pilot searching for gold and diamonds. This is where it got its name. In the movie The Hateful Eight, actor Kurt Russell smashed an authentic Martin guitar from the 1870s that was on loan from the Martin Guitar Museum. It was supposed to be switched out for a prop before he smashed it, but unfortunately, no one told Kurt. Australian Mark Murray has created a food combination called a ham dog. It's a hamburger and a hot dog combined and has a special shaped bun and is coming to America soon. Yummy! There's a mushroom species named after SpongeBob SquarePants. <laughs> oh, Mr. Krabs. The spongy form of SquarePantsy was named by researchers at San Francisco State University because it reminded them of the cartoon character. It's shaped like a sea sponge, has large holes in it, and has an orange color. Presidential candidate Dwight D. Eisenhower was the first politician to use political TV ads during his 1952 campaign. He created 40 20 second TV ads where he took questions from the audience. There are mushrooms that actually glow in the dark. Don't, don't eat these. The mushrooms, which are found in Brazil, are part of the genus Mycena,
Gallina, a group that includes about 500 species worldwide. Of these, only 33 are known to be bioluminescent. The world's smallest species of snake is the Leptotyphlops carlae, found in the Caribbean island of Barbados. An adult average size is just under 4 inches in length and is as skinny as a spaghetti noodle. In 1998, Sony actually had to recall 700,000 video cameras because customers discovered that the camera gave them the ability to see through clothes. They found that if the infrared lens was used in daylight, they could see details like tattoos, underwear, and body parts through certain types of clothing. There is an extremely rare congenital condition called polyorchidism, where a male is born with more than two testicles. According to biologist Dr. Sandra Goot of Sorbonne University in Paris, some frogs have evolved ultrasonic mating calls that they can use to be heard over rushing water to find a mate. According to the World Health Organization, approximately 265,000 people die every year from burns that occur mainly from home or the workplace. The Thenbode Padoga Temple in Myanmar contains over 582,000 Buddhas. In 2012, the Australian government did research for packaging tobacco products. They determined that the color Pantone 448C, also known as opaque kush, is the most offensive color to put beside the health warnings associated with smoking. They used it to make the cigarette packages look as unappealing as possible to dissuade people from smoking. Really though, do you need a color to tell you smoking's just nasty? But I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, hit that like button. Let me know you care. On the right, you'll find two of my most recent videos if you want to watch more. And subscribe because I'll have a brand new video for you on Monday at 3 Eastern Standard Time. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you then.